What's going on, guys? And welcome to the second to last board in uh, Mario Party 1. This is Bowser's Magma Mountain, and this is the first of the unlockable boards in the game. And, uh, yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of this board, let's just say, but uh, I'll go over to why in a bit. Now, uh, to unlock this board, you need to play all six board of the main board at least once, and then it will show up in the shop for 800 coins. So, uh, yeah, you have to buy it. And, uh, basically, uh, that's basically to get one of the two unlockables. Might see what's going to be a third. Yeah, I'm going third with a six. Anyway, so I chose Mario this board because I wasn't exactly sure who I was going to choose, but I chose Mario because I figured he'd be appropriate to play on a Bowser map. But, uh, yeah, so essentially we just have to get these, uh, two unlockable boards out of the way. So, uh, I'll kind of explain the whole gimmick to this board, but, um, but I'll explain what gets my turn. But first, I gotta do the uh, mini game skip. I can continue to save enough return. Must do it fast. So, um, yeah. So, um, well, she gets a two, so I can't really explain this. But I'll explain this more when it gets to my turn. But, uh, so I'm just gonna explain this anyway. So, uh, now the gist of this map is that, um, there's gonna be these, uh, forks in the road. And to take these, you have to pay ten coins. And on top of that, you have to roll a dice, and if you get the star, you pass, you go to if you get Bowser, you go the other way. And uh, this one right here actually determines whether or not you see Boo or Bowser. If you see the star, you go to Boo, if you see, get the Bowser, you see Bowser. And he can actually take a star or 20 coins. So, uh, yeah, it's one of two boards where you can flat out take a star. So, I'd honestly avoid Bowser all costs on this map, and uh, I'm just gonna go, uh, I'm just gonna go left. It's actually been a while since I've played this map. I do not come back to this board very often at all. Like, I want to say the last time I would have played... I'm trying to really think of the last time I would have played this map, but, uh, 1v3. Watch well, would have been Crane Game a second time, like, the, on the first turn, but, um... Anyway, so what we're gonna do now is, uh, try to see if we're gonna steal some coin bags. There we go. Okay, that landed right in my reach. Alright, can we get the coin bags? I got we got a coin bag, but uh we lost the hammer though, but um Yoshi get the There we go, we got the coin. Anyway, I think I got the most actually. Yeah, I got, I got 13, and the others got, like, uh, 5. So, uh, yeah, definitely, uh, improvement right there. But, um, we haven't seen, actually, uh, we haven't seen one of the roulettes yet, but, uh, because I just chose not to take it. So, uh, I'm not always good at those roulettes. I didn't get to minus clock. So, uh, if you get 10 coins, you're, if you don't have 10 coins, you're just forced to go the other way. So, uh, <laughs> I got 3. So, uh. It looks like we're taking the long... Also, happening spaces, they're going to turn all blue spaces into red spaces for a few turns. So, uh, yeah, this is going to be an easy map to get a 1v3 on. Which means it uppered the chance to get fucking crane game. So, we have Musical Mushroom, though, this time. So, let's just do the same strategy. We're going to, like, point the stick toward the chest. I almost lost that. <laughs> I definitely played Mario Party 1's minigames enough where, like, I think pretty much the big reason why I've had the clean sweep so far is that, uh, I've clean, clean swept all the main boards. Yeah, I'm just really good at minigames in general. Which definitely gives you an advantage of two bonus stars in this game. So, uh, my main advice is to get good at Mario Party 1, just get good at the minigames. And, uh, she's playing Knockwalk Tower. Which we have yet to get ourselves, actually. It is, I mean, I, like, I'm not always good at winning knock block tower. I can... The hard computers always win it, based on my knowledge, but, um... Watch me get castaways, like, twice again. Because, like, we got cat... Like, last war we got castaways twice, and it pretty much gave me the minigame star. And warp block. Oh, he's also playing a mini game, so, uh, yeah, he's gonna get whack a plant. More pedal power, so more stick rotating, but the AI's doing it, so, uh... Start. 
Go, 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 go. Come on, you can shred a few pounds if you ride this. Go, 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 go. No, he's catching up. Go, 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 go. All right, he got it. All right, so our turn. Uh, we can't take the, uh, and well, not if we go with Highlander 2, so, uh, yeah, that, uh, that one up there, we get a pass star, so, um, he's trying to go, just go straight for the star, but, uh, I really don't want to fucking play Box Mountain Mayhem. We've gotten this, like, six times so far. We got this twice last board, so, uh, I think I got a coin bag. Yeah, I think I just got a coin bag. Is this one? Is this one of my better rounds of Fox Mountain Mayhem? Because I think I got a couple coin bags. I got 24. Are you high? I mean, I'll take it, but I don't think I got that much. All right, so she's gonna just gonna go left. No one's gonna. Happy for you. It's pretty early in the game, though. Well, he gets a speed block, so, uh... Alright, so can I just get a... Can I roll higher than a three? Well, that's higher than a three, at least. You know what? Uh, we can't go up because we'll pass star. Let's try to see if we can get a look at this. Alright, there we go. There we go. We're on the map. I hope I don't go to Bowser, by the way. Oh, wait, no, no, no. All right, it's Wario. All right, so minigame time. Oh, it was almost Castaways. I think we only got Coin Block. We've seen Coin Block Bash, like, several times. We only saw Coin Block Lips, like, one other time, I think. Peach, Peach. Come on, give me the fucking. All right, there we go. Oh yeah! Finish. Bounce on their heads and get some coins. All right. I got eleven to seven to six. So yeah, we have eighty coins so far. So uh, yeah. And, uh, it's turn five, so, uh, we're pretty- we're still pretty early in the game, but, uh... And he's gonna get- I think he's gonna- I thought he was gonna get the half of for a second, so, uh... A number- what number, uh, I need a five or higher to get that star. Thank you. First star goes to Mario. God, I hope I don't see Bowser, because... This is one of two, both in the unlockable boards, Bowser can take stars when you encounter him, so I, you just want to avoid him at all costs. I want to say this is the Mario Party 1 board I've definitely played the least, because I've only just, I've only really ever played this board just to, like, unlock all the content. Like, I'm really trying to think of the last time I would have played this map. I certainly did not practice this. I did not practice any of the boards because I like, uh. All right, he's gonna go, he's gonna go ahead. We're actually gonna see the pink one. So is he gonna go towards Boo or Bowser? If he goes towards Bowser, it's a 1v3. So, um. All right, he's going to Boo. Alright, so I could take grab bag. I'm just I'm just good at grab bag in general, but um Alright, here we go. Alright, we got a coin bag. Peach. We got ten. Alright, we missed the Yoshi. Alright, avoid these guys. Get! 
Oh, we got one coin stolen. Alright, 15. Actually, 14. Guys, we're just stealing from Yoshi. Get! Alright, we lost our first point back. Come on! Peach, give me my coin bag back. Get! Alright, we got a lot. We got like 16 coins out of that. Actually, how many did we get actually? Because I only got, I haven't even got any coins. 33! Yep, I definitely have the minigame store now. <laughs> Alright, so, um, he's, I don't want us to give, like, boring commentary, like, a look at three, and, uh, and, uh, I really do not want to see Bowser. Alright, thank God, I'm not seeing Bowser. You want to, I've said this twice so far, you want to avoid Bowser at all costs. The no brainer was gonna steal from me. We all have to get. That was like six coins, so not too bad. Anyway, so mini game time. It's gonna be slot car derby, which we've only gotten a couple other times. So um. All right, here we go. Actually, pretty good at slot car derby. I think I'm better at the Mario Party One version than I am at the Mario Party Two version, though. Mario Party Two version I'm more hit or miss on, but Mario Party One version I'm pretty good at. To be fair, I played. I, I I probably I don't think I went over this already. I spun out, but I don't think I went over this. I actually did not play Mario Party Two until it came out in the Wii Virtual Console, where one and three I had on 64 cart. So. uh... Yeah, so I'd say of the N64 Mario Parties, 2 is the one I'm least familiar with. Another minigame win for the Mario. So, um... Anyway, so Peach is gonna get a plus block. I think she just got Bowser, too. Actually, she's gonna, she's gonna try the roulette. Let's see... Uh, try it. And she gets it. But she's gonna play a mini game! Yay! I just tried to I just I just tried to turn down my mic to prevent the um mic peaking, which there's been a lot of in this video, but uh maybe I'll change it to uh negative three dB, which that should be fine. I don't think that many of you wanna listen to mic peaking very much. And which one does she get? And she gets... And she gets it wrong! Haha. Uh -huh. And she just lost five coins. So, uh, she, they, well, they're actually tied for a second now, but, um... So, yeah, Wario is going to... Probably go for that, uh... Yeah, it's like she, she's gonna go for that too. Ah ha! Alrighty, so um, if I don't get a one or two, I get boo, which I don't thankfully. So uh, let's see who do I steal from? Uh, let's steal from Peach. How many? How many? Only three coins. That's lame. Well, I play a minigame at least. 
I would have preferred Whack a Plant though, but uh, I guess this game's been too generous with the mini games. All right, do I get the easy quest like last time? Last time I got the easy course, but I don't think this is going to be as generous. I, this looked like the easy course. The easy course is only one of the red ones. Yeah, we got the easy course again. Finish. Another win for us. And he's not gonna play a mini game, so uh, yeah, this 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 turn actually went out for quite a while. But uh, can we hop a bomb? Oh, hot rope jump. We only hot rope jump one of the time, I think. I think I forget which four, but I know we got hot rope jump one of the time. Which interesting thing is, when we play this in mini game island, we have to actually get forty of these jumps. But um, yes. It's one of the two mini games actually uh, that can say this character loses instead of the character wins. The other being Hop a Bomb, but it's not, it's it's pretty hard to lose this mini game. Let's just say because you just need to jump it twenty times and every and you just it's not one of those mini games where it's like the mini game never happened unless one character ends up losing this. Fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, and give me the coins. We'll give everyone the coins. Alrighty, so Peach is going to, um, I thought she was going to get Bowser for a second, but, uh, Wario is going to, thank God he get chance time. He's probably going to play the Bowser roulette. Or I see he's one short, but if he wins the minigame and sees Boo, he can steal a star, so. And I'm back to rolling twos. <laughs> if I can just keep the star in my coin star lead, I could probably be set for the rest of the game. Because this is not a very high scoring board, let's just say. Well, Yoshi's next to the star, so. Ooh, hammer drop. Nice. Alrighty, so give me the coin bag. I don't get the coin bag. I got one coin. I've only gotten one. All right, I can't chase that. I don't think I got that. Give me. I think I got that. Peach, stop stealing my fucking coin bags. I have been very hit or miss with Hammer Drop. I'm I'm nasty at the Mario Party Superstars version, but um, yeah, I've only gotten like maybe one. Co actually, that's two coin bags. Finish. Hey, uh, how many did I actually get? Yoshi actually fell off the last second, so uh, I got uh, I surprisingly got the most, which I'm gonna call bullshit on that. And this is uh, yeah, it's turn nine, so game's a little ha almost halfway done. I'm wondering who's gonna get that star. I probably might have. Wait a minute. Well, I'm not seeing Bowser, thankfully. Yoshi's probably gonna steal my star, though, but, um. Oh, I get a happening space, so. I mean, I'll take the bonus star for the low roll. However, I think it's either going to be 1v3 or 2v2, um, because Yoshi's going to get a red space. Alright, he's either seeing Boo or Bowser, so I'm hoping he gets Bowser. If it's Boo, he steals my star. Oh, I'm getting my star stolen. Well, good thing I have all the bonus stars right now. Oh, he's only stealing coins. I guess they don't really steal stars if it's too early in the game, so I guess that's a plus. Oh, you got one coin! One coin! And, uh, he's gonna get Crane Game. Chronos Pursuit. Thank God I'm not Crane Game. I wouldn't like Tug of War either. I don't think there's been a single round in this playthrough that hasn't had a, at least one stick rotating minigame, but, uh, 
I think it's much, I don't, it's much easier the, to win as the one in this, especially when the AI is the three, but um, I think they balance it out much more in the Mario Party Superstars version, but um, yeah, it's like really hard for the one to lose in this. You just, you just have to be a good button masher. But if you lose the one, you lose like 15 coins. So I've seen the one lose in this. And like, it's easy to win as the one, but if you make one fuck up, it can be like devastatingly bad. Finish. All right, he gets... He gets 15 coins. If, it's essentially with the 1v3 is if you win, you get 15 coins. If you lose, you get like, uh, you lose 15 coins. Essentially, uh, Marpet won in a nutshell. Marpet won's really the only game in the series that makes you lose coins. There's more pretty nine that makes you lose mini stars, but we're gonna get to that game uh, someday. It's like I've already talked about how bad Mario Party 9 is, but um, that's another day. That's way in the future. We still have eight more games to get to. Yeah. Hmm. So uh, that's on the other side of the map where I am. Well, she's not. She's probably just gonna go. Uh, well, she got the happening space, so she's probably just gonna go up, and I get it that way. So it's either gonna be four player or one v three. Oh, I got a speed block. That that's nice after all the twos I've gotten. I thought it was gonna land on chance time for a second, but um. All right, don't be a 1v3. Thank you. Tipsy Tourney, we've seen this minigame enough. We, essentially what we're gonna, I've gone over this the last three boards. But we're, we're gonna get all repeats for the rest of the playthrough because uh, Mario Party 1 is only 50 minigames. So, um. Oh, shit. Okay, that's a that's definitely a, a sloppy run of a tipsy turn. I might even lose this oxygen. Didn't. That was definitely a sloppy run of tipsy turn. Eh? I have 155 coins. Can I break 200 coins for the third board? Because the next board is not going to be a high scoring coin start at all. So we're actually halfway done. We've only only been playing for 20 minutes. So yeah, she's going to go for that star. Haha! Uh -huh. You're not getting that star. He's also gonna go for that star, so, um... We go for two on this. Ah, uh, not, no, we're not going for two on that one. Well, good news is if I can make it to Boo, I can steal a star, so... Hey, the... It's, the bases are blue again, so, um... I almost thought I was gonna land on the happening space again. Alright, so... He's gonna get chance time. I know that for a fact, so... Oh, yeah, chance time. I love how it defaults to me given coins. Alright, and first contestant is none other than Wario, and the second contestant is none other than myself, which I don't like this at all. Of course, I have to give up my star. And Wario's about to buy a star, too. Yeah, it was only a matter when I was going to get screwed in chance time, but, uh... The game's not over till it's over, I guess. But the problem is, Wario's about to buy a star, so. Hand car havoc, we've definitely seen this one enough. I don't wanna feel, I don't really feel like button mashing right now, but I have to in order so Wario can lose coins.
Am I to lose this? Oh, well, we're in the lead. Oh, it's it's dead heat. Come on! We're slightly ahead. We just need to pull through. We got this, and yeah. I can't seem to break that record, though. All right, so. Is she gonna get Bowser? No, she's not. I almost thought she was gonna get a chance time, and I wouldn't have liked another chance time, but um, he's gonna get another star. Yeah. Um, I hope you see Bowser and lose essentially, well, he, he essentially lose his star. So, uh, I guess then logically it'd be a 50-50 chance if he saw Bowser if he would lose my star or his, but um, one of his stars is mine, and that's the point. Well, good news is I'm built right next to that one, so. Alright, please see Bowser. Please see Bowser. Please see Bowser. Come on, come on. You can do it. No one's gonna see Bowser. I'm probably gonna be the only one that's actually gonna get Bowser. Of course. And what number do I need to get that star? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight or eight, seven or higher. That is not enough. Probably gonna be a 1v3, but as long as I'm not bashing cash, I should be fine. Or tug of war. Actually, Yoshi's gonna get that star instead. Amazing. Please get Bowser so I can get that star. Thank you. Guess who's not getting a no star for you? I don't know why I tried to do a like a suit Nazi thing from a Seinfeld. I actually read something once that the Soup Nazi was basically actually based on a real-life, uh, soup store they encountered in New York City when writing that show. And then, like, uh, the guy they based it off of took great offense to that episode of Seinfeld. It's, like, really, it's really interesting to read about. But we're playing Tug of War, so... No, we're losing it! No, we're not losing this! No, I am not falling in the pit. Come on, come on, no! I am not falling and losing coins. I don't care if this ends on a draw. Fuck. Finish. Oh yeah. That is a nice, a blister and a red rash on my hand because Nintendo thought this was a good idea. And I thought it was a good idea to play on original hardware. So, um... Okay. Well, Wario has the second chance to get Bowser, so that's solid. Is he gonna get chance time again? No, he's not. Oh, great! I'm guaranteed that star now, so that's solid. He put that star on the right, so I don't have to, uh, see Bowser. And good, I have to get Boo if I want that. I don't even think it's really worth going for, because both Wario and Peach are close to that. And I don't want to see Bowser, and, um... Yeah, I I'm gonna try to see if I can play a minigame. I don't want to see Bowser. Plus, I don't think I can possibly get that star. Fuck you! Well, I'm seeing Bowser anyway. Don't be a Bowser revolution. Please don't. I don't want to lose my other star. Okay, no, uh... Don't be bashing cash. Alright, Bowser's chance time. Who am I going to screw out of a star? 
All right, I'm hoping I can screw Wario out of a star. So do I screw Wario out of a star and I screw Peach out of a star? Yeah, I, I, I screwed Peach out of that star. So I, it's not a bad thing I got Bowser with that because Wario can't afford that star and neither can Peach. But Yoshi's also gonna get, try to go for that star. So maybe not actually. Because I'll get chance time instead where I'll lose my other star. Can I get my star back, please, Yoshi? Peach, and the second contestant is... Well, Peach just lost all of... I don't think she even has that much. It's like four coins. Yeah, four coins. Problem is, Yoshi's gonna be the one in this, so it's probably gonna be Crane Game, because we know my luck with this board so far. Well, at least it wasn't Crane Game, I'll give it that. I don't want- I don't like the idea of him getting Coin Shower Flower, but Crane Game would've been much worse. Crane Game can Crane Game alone can cost you the game in this game. I'm not the idea of Yoshi, biggest idea of Yoshi getting 30 something points. That's because I think he's second in the minigame star, so, uh. I'm just trying to see if I can nab some coins. Um, you're bet. I definitely am able to be able to get five of the three, so, like, uh. If you want to talk about an unbalanced minigame, this is, like, the king of them. I think fair amount, at, for, at least for the three-player standard, but, um... Yeah, I got six. Yoshi got 33, though, so, uh... He's not... He's 50 coins short of the coin star, so I... Alright, so... Wario is going to... Oh, that's perfect. The less coins he has, because he cannot get a third star... And he's not seen Bowser, so that's a problem. Alright, so... Actually, I can just... If I can get Boo on this, I can steal Wario Star and nab that star, so... Oh, 1v3, so this is a problem. Don't. Okay, it's not. None of them are gonna be crane game. It's fashion cash. I like that more. I'm gonna do the same strategy before I just lay the others. Uh, when it's Bowser fashion cash, though, you want to play a different strategy because you don't get any of the coins. I didn't get that coin bag, but I don't care. Warrior can... As long as Warrior doesn't get 10 coins, he should be fine. Yoshi just lost 30 coins. He's got nothing also. I got 25. Can you steal from Wario so he can't possibly get that star, even with Boo? Thank you. Stealing from Boo is not going to give her the star, but as long as, uh, yeah, I don't think Wario can get that star now. I just can't get Bowser, because uh, this is either going to make or break the game, probably. Because, yeah, next turn's last five turns, so this is probably going to make or break the game. If I see Boo, I dominate, and if I see Bowser, I get screwed, so... We're just gonna be a gamble, actually. Wait, no, okay. He's gonna pass that star. But he is gonna play a minigame, but... Good thing is that the Reverse Mushroom doesn't exist yet. Which, Reverse Mechanics, they have not brought back since Mario Party 3, but, uh... Ghost Guess, we already, uh, we've played this once, and we, the AI played it a couple times, too. There. All right. And he got it. Finish. 
this is probably gonna be a high scoring mini game, sorry, because we've gotten a lot of a lot of one player mini games, a lot of coin mini games. I think Yoshi's second in the mini game star, but I think I would most likely have it. All right, get. Yeah. And uh, am I gonna get screwed or blessed? All right, one, two, three, four. All right, thank God, thank God, I'm not seeing Bowser. Thank God, I'm not seeing Bowser. Meanwhile, I'm going to change this game entirely. We're gonna steal a star from Wario. And on top of that, we're just gonna get the star normally. So yeah, we just get two stars in one turn. So now the only way I can possibly lose is by a chance time, which it can happen during the last five turns. But uh, yeah, I definitely uh, turn the game around just now. Next turn's gonna be the last five turns, so, uh, yeah, it's like, uh... It's interesting, because Shy Guy says it's a classic minigame, but we've only seen it, like, a, maybe a couple times, I think. There's, you know, like, the really bad minigames we've seen, like, six times, and the classic ones we've seen, like, only once. Like, we've only seen bumper balls like twice, and that was in, including the time the game crashed. So, even though bumper ball isn't really one of my favorite mini games. Alright, Wario's out. Yoshi's out. Alrighty, so I think this is the last five turns, so we've only been playing for less than 40 minutes, so yeah, dude, this is definitely going quick. It's not a board I come back to often at all. Like, I think the last time I played this was the last time I would have uh, unlocked everything, which um, I'm trying to think that was. I don't think, I really don't think I've played this board, like maybe five years, I think. And Bowser, just great. And it's gonna be, it's gonna be Bowser Revolution. Bowser's facelift, that's fine. As long as it's not Tug of War, because we already played Tug of War. All right, what's the face gonna be? Eh, I'll take that one. All right, just uh, get the uh, eyebrows like this. Then, uh, I think we gotta move the nose up a bit, and that should be fine. In fact, that's flawless. Definitely better than what the rest of them have, especially Wario. Yoshi's is by far the worst. Like, one, one cheek's, like, crooked, and the other's, like, uh, straight, so the nose is crooked, too, so Yoshi's not getting 80 points. Yoshi, I knew Yoshi was the worst, so I only got 92 out of that, so. Anyway, so, um, I got a plus block. I thought I was gonna land on Bowser again. I think the star is upwards, so yeah. Pretty much the the only way I'm gonna lose is by a chance time, so I'm hoping that doesn't happen. I already lost a star in chance time, so it has to be a star trade in order for me to lose. And uh, yeah, Yoshi's got the happening star right now. He's got two where I've got one. Sorry, um. Sometimes I have a habit of humming music, but, um... 
and not like to, uh, all right, bowl over. Uh, who's the one? I think Wario's the one in this. Alrighty, so stay with me, other two. No, don't go towards me. Try to get away from me. All right, I'll stay on the top left. I'll stay away from the other two. And I'm the only one to get hit. All right, four turns left. Um, Bowser again. It's gonna be revolution this time. We've been, it's, it's, I've been waiting for this to happen. There we go. I wondered when this was gonna happen, but uh, yeah, this divides everyone's points evenly. So my 90 something coins are gonna go to like 50, 48 actually. But hey, like, um, if we see a, if you can see a Bowser Revolution on the last five turns, there's a good chance we can see a full-on dice block with one person, with two people. Well, I get to play a mini game, so I'm too short of the star, but, um, oh, sweet. I have yet to play Memory Match. All right, so, um... Let's see, and this panel contains uh, Cooper Shell, and this one contains uh, green one up, one up mushroom. So the other one up was over here. All right, regular mushroom. That's a Cooper Shell. So let's get the other Cooper Shell. You just want to avoid getting the Bowser, and you should be fine. But that was the Bowser. All right. 50-50. Oh, shit. This will be a heartbreaker. Yeah, we got five seconds. This is going to be a heartbreaker. There we go. I almost lost that completely. You still get the coins if you get a match. You just don't get... You only get ten if you get all of them. Alrighty, so Yoshi is going to, I was going to say, don't fucking get a three. We haven't seen anyone get Bowser yet, but, um, if you see Bowser, you roll a, you roll a, oh, never mind. But if you see Bowser, someone's going to roll, you get to roll a block. And, uh, if you, if you get a star, you lose a star. If you get the coins, you lose 20 coins. So, um, I don't want to stick rotate. I really don't. All right, here. let's try a different route. Let's try to like, let's try to do it with our thumb. Which is actually working better, actually. Because that's how the game designers intend you to do it. But, um... Actually, like, um, the thumb's actually working better, actually. What the fuck? I'm, I'm not trying this with Tug of War, but, um... The interesting thing is, I've, I've historically been very good at Paddle Bell, but I might be past my prime with this mini game. I guess the Antonia do I have the same way you spin Bowser or Mario 64? Because I got a lot of coins just now. Yeah, I got 18 coins. Again, I really do not want there to be a chance sign. I, it's not in my best interest. And, uh, looks like she's gonna play a mini game. We've seen a ton of one-player mini games just now, so, uh... Alright, Teetering Towers. Alright, we've... We have not played this ourselves, actually, I don't think. I don't think we actually... I think we... I don't think we actually played this ourselves. We've seen the AI, like, play this three different times. Actually, she fell off! Miss. But yeah, if you fall off, you lose five coins, except if you collected coins along the way. 
I'm going to see Wario in Yoshi's position because Yoshi has the happening star, so we might see a full on dice block for last place. Never mind, because he's going to get chance time and change the whole fucking game. I really don't want there to be another star trade. I really don't. Wario, please don't do this a second time. Wario, I swear to fucking God. I swear to God. Oh, thank you, actually. So yeah, no dice block for us, unfortunately. It, dice blocks are rare to happen, let's just say. Like, I've been playing Mario Party for over 20 years. I've yet to see a, a win or loss by a dice block. I swear to God. Okay, I got the star. Alrighty, so... I don't think anyone's gonna get to that one. Too far away. I think actually it's gonna go back to Blue's. Yeah, it's gonna go back to Blue's. But we're gonna see Bowser. I think if you don't have a star, though, I think he just takes 20 coins. Yeah, he just takes 20 coins and not a star. But uh, if you have a star, you just spin a roulette. Actually, Yoshi's gonna get that star, so... um. Oh, sweet. We get the Blake Coin Shower Flower. We can take that. Like, that might work better than Crane Game with all the other, with what everyone else has in coins. Star. Actually, I think we got coin. Actually, we did get. We got Coin Shower Flower when we played DK Jungle Adventure, and that gave us the minigame star. So, uh. I don't think it's gonna make much of a difference this time, but, um. Yeah, if we had not gotten Coin Shower Flower, we'd have, we would have flat out lost DK Jungle Adventure. So, uh. I honestly even think in retrospect I really should have lost DK Jungle Adventure, but I just got really lucky that board. Finish. How many did I get? Please, can I beat Yoshi's score? And I got a uh, 39 actually. I really, I really don't want there to be a chance time because I have dominated this so far. Did he? He didn't. He's one off, though, so that is kind of a problem. There's gonna be a 1v3, so... Yeah, I'm not gonna get that happening star, unfortunately, but, um, he's gonna get that star. He rolls exactly enough. So, yeah, I think Yoshi solidified second place, because he's got the happening star. Alright, next star... Uh... I'm not... Uh, I don't want to go... I'm not going to go for that one because I really do not want to get Bowser. So I don't want to really, really, really chance it. Plus, I can win without a star... Without getting an additional star. Well, he's not going to get a chance time. So, um... Alright. Don't be Crane Game. Not on there. Paddle Battle again. Alright. Pressing Method. We're the three on this, but uh, let's try the same method. Yeah, this is, a lot, this is a lot better, actually. Like, I know the game design is intended to do it the same way you do it in Mario 64, but, uh... I'm just doing it with my thumb, actually. Well, we did we did uh, lose a three coins, but we're doing a lot better this time. I like when Wario screams like that. Ugh! Like Wario's voice in this game is like meme worthy. And we got seven coins each. He just lost all his coins. 
All right, last turn. Yeah, uh, she's, I don't think she rolled enough to get that star, so... I unfortunately think if she gets Bowser, she gets chance time, so... Oh, fuck. No! No chance that... Actually, is she gonna get chance time? Okay, she missed it by one, so I miscalculated right there. So, don't get a one. Don't get a one. Okay, thank you. As long as there's no chance times, so he doesn't have ten coins. All right. Don't get a four. Don't get a four. Don't get a four. Okay, he missed it by one. Alrighty, so, and I'm going to... Uh, let's try to see if we can tie up the happening star. I'm one and one on this, and I'm one, two and one on this, so at least I get to tie back up the happening star. So yeah, I can't possibly lose this now with less of a chance I'm in. Yoshi isn't close enough. Like, it would have to be a full-on star trade for me to lose, but he gets a one. Oh, fuck you! No! We are not doing this! We're not doing this on the very last turn! We're no! No! We're not doing this on the last turn! Alright, look, let's just do the contestant, blah blah blah, and uh, of course, he's gonna pick me. Oh my god, don't, don't, don't. Oh my god! Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious? I'm tied with him for happening, Star, so I just fucking lost this. Are you fucking serious? This is, this can't be real. I am not very happy right now that uh, my clean sweep isn't going to continue, but uh, because I have I have to flat out sweep the bonus stars, and I'm tied. I think I'm tied with Yoshi for happening. I am not very happy right now that I just lost three stars. Finish. I just said um, I can't possibly lose, so I probably should not open my big fat mouth. Alrighty, so I have to sweep the bonus stars in order to win this, and I think I'm tied with Yoshi for happening, so... Yeah, we'll see how this goes. Alright, game star. Well, that's a good sign. I don't think I, I don't think I have happening star. That's the problem. Point star Mario is um. I think I'm tied with Yoshi for having it. I think he got two and I got two. So yeah, it really sucks that my clean my perfect sweep cannot continue, let alone on the very very last turn. So uh, yeah, it really does suck that, that happened. Because it happened not only on the last turn, the last player controlling. Like, if that last turn went any differently, I would have won this. And I think Wario got last. I think it's Wario that got last, actually. The last player's person doesn't get destroyed in this board, but, uh... Yeah, let's just say I am not the most happy that I just lost on the very last turn. Alright, Yoshi. You do not you do not deserve that win right there, but uh Yeah. Wario got last, so uh Look at how much I was dominating until that last turn. Like 264 coins in minigames. Like I was completely dominating this game until the last turn. Alright. Well, I get... I guess that's kind of a... Poor, I guess that's kind of like pouring bandages on the wound, where like, uh... Anyway... I am really disappointed I could not clean sweep all the boards in this, but uh, we still have one more board to play, so we can hopefully turn things around. But, uh, 
Yeah, so uh, join us next week where we join us next time we play uh, Eternal Star, the final board in the game. See you guys then.